Now to an on your side investigation tonight. A Jacksonville pet owner is feeling relieved, but still very emotional about what she just discovered. Four months she thought her beloved pet was cremated and she has been waiting on the ashes. And then she discovered that what she thought had happened mm -hmm. had not taken place. It was supposed to happen in March. Yeah, she reached out to on your side's Ken Amaro, who's looking into what happened. Pets are part of the family until the end, and when there's a loss, the loss is very painful. Luna was Anna Warren's companion for a decade. She was my life. She was my baby. In March, stricken with cancer, Luna was put to sleep. I cried harder than I've ever cried before um, for days. Her pet was euthanized at this animal hospital and was supposed to be cremated, but it never happened. Where's the body of my dog? The pet crematory never received Luna's body. And this week, Warren discovered it was never sent. So she's just been sitting in there for months, you know? Um, How does that make you feel? It makes me feel upset. On your side was told that Luna's paperwork was misfiled by a former part-time technician at the hospital. I've been doing very good at moving on, but when that happened, it was just heartbreaking all over again. Dr. John Rossi told us he was completely unaware of the problem. We're terribly sorry for the emotional distress, he says. This is the first time in my 34 years this has happened. We're taking care of it and the costs. Are you satisfied yeah, with his apology? I, I am, and I think he's always been a great doctor to me. Warren says so she would like to see a follow-up system in place for all patients. My crazy I made a garden for her, and I want to put her ashes in there. I want to be sure that they're her ashes. The pet crematory confirms it will pick up Luna on Friday and complete the process. In this case, the situation looks like it's being resolved and was all a case of human error. And to avoid human error going forward, if you need to deal with a pet crematory, deal with the pet crematory directly. Ken Amaro, First Coast News, on your side. Whew. Well, remember, if you have a problem, we're on your side. Just send us an email to onyourside at firstcoastnews.com.